In this video, we show an example of the mean value theorem for integrals. Suppose we have the function f of x equals x squared, and we want to find the c that produces the average value of this function on the interval from 0 to 3. So the first thing we have to do is just figure out that average value. So f of c equals 1 over b minus a, which here is just 3, integral from 0 to 3 of x squared dx. Very simple integral. The antiderivative, of course, is x cubed over 3. And we evaluate at 3 and 0. And then when we plug in and evaluate, we find that this average value is 3. In other words, the average height of this function is a height of 3. And so then the question just becomes, what x produces that? Well, now we have to solve the equation f of x equals 3, x squared equals 3, x equals plus or minus the square root of 3. Well, only one of these is actually in the interval concern, and that would be positive square root of 3. So c equals the positive square root of 3, and this is the value that we plug into f to make f equal its average value. This is interesting because it gives us a method for finding the average value of something that is changing. Because we have just a list of numbers, we add up the list and divide by the number on the list. That gives us the average of the list. But well, here, instead of a list, what we have is a function, something continuously changing along an interval. And this gives us a method for finding the average on that interval.